Okay, so this is something I just got in the mail the other day. Uh, and some of my previous videos actually with the bike were uh, used with this on. Now I use a Sony uh, CX110 little video camera. Uh, here's a little picture of it. And this is about as wide as it goes, right here. So not overly wide. Uh, and if I'm trying to, you know, hold the camera out and record myself, um, it's hard to get your arms back far enough. So I decided to go with um, get a little wide angle. So you'll see that this is a point point four three. So right there, but it's a point four three fisheye. Um, so a little different than some of the the actual point fours and whatever that are out there. Um, because this really gets that really wide look on it. Um, and this is the Optica uh, HD2. Okay. So, one of the things that I found uh, looking around, uh, on eBay or Amazon or wherever you're looking, uh, a whole bunch of these point fours. but there's a couple reviews up there and some video samples that I looked at, and... Uh, this is the one that I seem to kind of focus to. So here it is in the box. I've already opened it, but I put everything back in there. Now the one thing that came with it that um, yours may or may not come with, depending. Uh, this had a step up ring, so uh, my camera uses a 30 mil uh, ring on it or fil filter size so for the thread. Um, and it needed a step up, so I think out of the box these are, I'm not even sure, 35 or something like that. But, so it needed a step up ring. I'd show you that, but it's actually physically attached to this camera right now. So, what does this come with? So, right out of the box, there it is, there's the bag. You can see I can't get far enough, right? So it's be helpful. So, there's the actual lens with the little bag. Uh, bunch of, I don't know, instructions or something, and really last but not least, a little cleaning cloth. Um, I guess that's useful. Um, does come with silica gel in there just for moisture. Uh, let's see, so there it is, nice little optical bag, pop it out. Okay, I'm trying to do this with one hand, which makes it fun. So yeah, so this this will be used for this camera. Uh, a couple reasons it will either be when I'm riding, or uh, not actually probably physically attached to the bike, but something to take with me, so that when I'm riding somewhere else, when I stop, I actually have a camera that can um, actually record somewhat decent audio. Uh, compared to the action cams, you know, the little Vivitars and that. So anyway, this is the lens right here. Now you'll see it's just like a lot of those phones or those phone lenses that you can get. So it's made up of two. So the has the little macro piece. So this macro piece here can unscrew from the main one. Um, and so you can use that one by itself or the two of them together. Uh, I use the two of them together. So it comes with the main cap and a bottom one. So I'm going to take this off and I'm just going to, and I apologize right now for the mess on my table if it gets wide enough to see all this. So there it is right here. Okay, And I'm physically just going to, and you can see I'm at full wide right now on my camera. I'm going to take this and just kind of put it up against it and you can see the difference. You can actually see the whole table. Um, one of the nicest things that I found about this that was a big concern was, again, when this is in full wide, um, you can see a little bit of the camera edges, edges up in the corner, so the vignetting of the lens, but not bad. You know, all you have to do is zoom in just a tad to get rid of them, which is awesome. So there it is at full wide, where you can see everything on the table, including the actual outsides of the table compared to there. So that's a big difference, right? So 
um, for 30 I think it was 30 35 dollars something like that um, I think this is a fantastic little lens now you will notice um, there it's fairly sharp it's sharp at wide but when you start creeping in and you see it um, it does soften a little bit but what do you expect for a thirty dollar piece of glass right so yeah I'm uh, pretty happy with it it's gonna be great for taking out because for one it's small easy to remove add and you can get that wide shot when you require it so there you go so the Optica 0.43 AF fisheye high definition 2 platinum series there you go very cool excellent guys but there you go we'll talk to you again later ciao